Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a little shopping haul, surprise, surprise. Um, I'm in my boyfriend's room, so that's why it looks a bit different. Yes, the Happy Valentine's sign is still there. That's been there for like two years now, two <laughs> Valentine's days. But it was like, oh, I'll take it down after this Valentine's day, just gone. I was like, no, you may as well just leave it up now. <laughs> it's a tradition of it being there, so yeah. Sorry, I was just checking my hair out. Look at this, because it was neat this morning. And then look at all my hair, like, coming out of a plait now. Um, we went into... Excuse me, you We went into Sheffield Centre today, because um, we didn't know what else to do. Um, the lighting's a bit janky in here, but I can't do anything about it. Um, but yeah, so I've got a few bits. Obviously, some stuff from Primark. <laughs> I didn't plan on going in Primark. I didn't even plan on buying much today. I just wanted to have a look around and then sort of have, like, a, a, a drink and some lunch or whatever. Um, what was I going to say? But yeah, I ended up going into Primark last night. My boyfriend went into, I think it was JD Sports or something. or No, Sports Direct. Um, so I just like my top. It's really cute, isn't it? It's like puffy sleeve, but it's got like um, little flowers on. I do believe this was actually from um, George at Asda. But anyway, yeah. And I spent £31, I think, in Primark. Which is because I saw a really cute jumper that I'll have to show you. And that's the thing that costs the most. Um, so yeah. Um, I didn't just get stuff from Primark, I've got other things. So let's show you the other things first. So, first thing is this little um, stitch, if you can see, the like um, mystery pin. So you don't know which one you're going to get. It's going to be one of those, if you can see. Is it going to focus? I don't know if it is. Uh, but that was five ninety nine. Um, that was from um, an independent shop somewhere in Sheffield. I think it's called Forbidden Planet or something. But I love stitch, so I got that. Um, then we also went into Bird's Yard, which is a great little shop because it sells loads of like, it has loads of little independent sellers stuff in there. Let's see if we can get the lighting a bit better. Is it better if I'm there? I don't know. You just have to deal with it, like the bad lighting. So anyway, uh, so yeah, so it has loads of nice little independent sellers in there. I always love getting stuff in there. Um, I've seen these before. I think they're called little dinkies. And it's basically little messages wrote on like um, pieces of like wood. And I got this one for my mum and it says, rate love you. And it was a pound. They have all sorts. Um, they have ones like that. They have ones that say miss you, like good luck on your driving. Um, or well done for passing, that kind of thing. And they have like cute little images. And for a quid, I didn't think that was bad. Rate love you. So I'll give that to my mum. I then did get myself a little ring, which was £10. I don't know if you can, oh gosh, how am I going to show you this best? If you can see, but it's like a little twist. And that was £10 and it is sterling silver. Um, and it's adjustable, if you can see. Um, so obviously I'm not going to do it now, so I don't want to break it. But um, I'll be able to adjust it to my like ring size. Um, so I thought that was really cute. I just liked it because it's like a little knot. If you can see, it's really cute. Um, so for £10, I thought that was nice. Um, I'm not quite sure what the independent sellers were called in Bird's Yard, but you need to go to Bird's Yard if you go to Sheffield. They sell so many cute things. Um, right, I'll show you the things I got from Primark then. So the first thing that I got from Primark is something that I wanted last year, but they ran out and I never did manage to get one. And it is this, um, let me just flip back to the back, look. It is this racer top, but it's the one with the inbuilt bra. So it's got like the inbuilt um, like cups in, in it, so you don't have to wear a bra. Because my whole thing is, they do sell normal racer tops, but what bra do you wear with a racer top? Because it doesn't sit where your bra strap sits, so you'd have to wear like a strapless bra, which just isn't comfortable, or no bra at all. And then, you know, you're going to have a whole situation going on. So... I thought that was really cute and I was like oh my god please have it in my size I didn't think I had it on my, in my size because I could only see the smalls on the top and then I looked below and I was like oh thank god because they all went really quick last year um so yeah and you know what it's like at the back as well you know what a race the top's like at the back like that and it was 14 pounds I do believe that's my boyfriend coming into the room oh actually sorry it wasn't 14 why you're not going to come into the video like that um it was eight pounds Why have you got a Star Wars mask on your head? Is anyone else's boyfriend weird like this? I don't think 
You should stay there for the rest of the video now. Babe, either leave or stay. Does anyone else have a boyfriend like this? You do one. Thank you. Goodbye. He's still got his towel on from where he's been in the shower. He's just got a towel on. He's coat and the Star Wars head. I just, why? But anyway, yeah, these again, yeah, they went really quick last year. And I don't know why I said £14, but they're only £8, which isn't bad at all, to be fair. It's got a built-in bra. I've got it in a size medium. And I thought that'd be cute to wear under, like, um, cardigans and stuff, you know, as it's getting warmer in spring. So I'm really happy I got that, actually, because they did go pretty quick last year. They were quite popular. Um, then I went into the makeup section and got myself a couple of bits and my mum um, one thing. Oh, i going to over. So I got myself this little blush um, eyeshadow palette for £2.50. And these are the colours. Can you see them? The lighting's not that good in here. Let me see if I can get the lighting better. See? No? They're the colours. I don't know if you can see them very well. But like the like pinks and stuff in there. So they're quite pretty. Uh, but for £2.50, I didn't think that was bad. You get six shades and like there's a few pinks in there and they're kind of cute. I don't know why there's a black in there. But anyway, if it's a blush one. But anyway, the ones I will use the most are probably um, these um, and that one actually as well. The brown one I might use a little bit, but the black one not at all. Um, but for £2.50, I thought that was really good. Uh, and then I got my mum the neutral one, which was again £2.50. The lightning here is atrocious. Um, what did you say? The lightning here is rubbish. The light? Yeah. Um, so I got my mum the neutral one, which again was £2.50. That's obviously just got neutral shades in it, if you can see. <laughs> And then I also got myself um, a liquid blush and it's in the shade Peach. It's pretty. I did have a look in the shop and this has like got the packaging over it. I'll try and show you. Um, so if I show you, it like comes out like that. <laughs> Thanks. And it's that kind of colour. You see better now. You ought to have been there for the whole video. I needed it really. Well, let me try and show them the um, eyeshadow palettes then, because my boyfriend's doing a bit of lighting for me. Can you see them better now? Ah, oh, that's much better. So they're the pink ones, look, and they're the neutral ones. Yeah, that's much better. Um, so yeah, that's those. So the next thing is this lovely jumper. Look how cute it is. It's like pink and white, but it's stripes, but like they're not conventional stripes. They're like wavy stripes, which I thought was really, really cute. And like I was walking past it, I was like, I don't need any more jumpers, but that is so cute, I can't like pass up on it. And this was what made me go up to like £31 in Primark because um, it was £15. Um, I have got one that's like sort of similar to this, I think in one of my other videos, it's um, from the same sort of range and it's got like multicoloured, but it's not like stripes, it's different colours on it. I don't know how to explain it. They're like straight across stripes, but in different colours. Um, but look how cute it is. Isn't that lovely? Let me take the sticker off so it's like, you can see it better without the sticker being there. But obviously that's just it at the back. It's actually quite soft to be fair. But yeah, I just thought how unusual and how cute is that? I'll try and flip that over. And then at the end it's just a little white on the sleeves. But because it's like wavy, I thought that was really cute. And like obviously pink is one of my favourite colours and because it's like wavy um stripes i just thought that was really pretty so yeah for 15 pounds and um, that'll be nice again in the spring just wear with some jeans and some trainers maybe a vest up underneath if it's got like a bit of a cool breeze um so that's what made me go up to 31 pounds in there because that was the most expensive thing yep the jumper was 15 bralette eight eyeshadow parts 2.50 each and the liquid blush 3.50 um so yeah that is everything that i got in sheffield today um i do hope you've enjoyed this little video i know it's not been very long i know the lighting's been a bit weird and i'm in like a different setting um uh, but with that said i do hope you enjoyed the video um i do think these are really good as well these little palettes because they really enjoyed it thanks babe that wasn't me that was shut much. up um i really like these little palettes because they're perfect for i might even just leave this one at my boyfriend's because they're perfect for like travel or whatever because they're really oh, tiny I'm in my room. 
Babe, shut up. <laughs> and you can just like take them with you because they're really tiny and cute. I don't have pigment in the R, I will have to let you know, but for £2.50, I thought they were cute. That's the blush in the neutral one. Um, I'm excited to try the liquid blush because I've only got like cheek tints and I've got the other um, like cream blush from Primark, but it's that one like the Dofer that you stick on, like you dab on your face. So I'm excited to try this one. Sometimes they smell really nice, don't they? But that one doesn't. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, I'm rambling now. Um, thank you so much for watching the video. As always, I do appreciate it. Leave a like, a comment. No, a like, a comment. Um, subscribe if you would like to. It's free. Um, hit the notification bell if you want to be uh, notified every time I upload. Um, thank you again so much for watching. And with that said, stay safe, stay well, stay you. Love yourself. You're perfect just as you are. And I hope to see you in the next one. Bye, guys.